Hi everyone, it's Heather. Welcome back into the Paper Castle. Uh, I was going to do a combined, like, updated sales and uh, my haul video from this past weekend, but my store's been so busy this week that I got to split it up in two. But I'm not complaining at all. Um, I've been very, very lucky with sales the past couple of weeks. So I'm going to start out with that and then I'll come back with a haul video. I know it's like almost into this coming weekend and I haven't done it yet, but it was a really crazy week. A lot of family events and stuff going on. So I'm going to get started. Um, let's see, that box set I showed you guys, was it last week or the week before? The video where I showed the Little House on the Prairie DVD set, because I got a lot of comments about that. Um, so a lot of you should remember that one. I had a box set of CDs from the songs from the 80s. It was called um, Left of the Dial, and it was brand new and sealed. I bought it for 5 and I sold it this week for $80 with free shipping. But that already got shipped, so I can't show you that. Uh, I sold this Yankees pin that I've had for a while now. I think maybe I got it for a quarter and sold that for four ninety nine with free shipping. So didn't make a whole lot on that. Uh, let's see this little Harmony Kingdom pig box. This is the Harmony Kingdom mark. Bought it for twenty five cents at a rummage sale. Sold it for I think I'm gonna make about twelve on it because. I think it sold for thirteen fifty or fourteen, something like that, with free shipping. Sold the hike or die mug that I bought recently at another rummage sale. Paid twenty five cents. Sold it for ten. And the guy lives in Austria, so he actually has to pay twenty dollars to have it shipped to him. But I will never, for the life of me, understand that. But they keep buying, even though the prices, you know, spiked back in uh, January. Uh, this one, this is the Winnie the Pooh, like, figural mug that I bought at a rummage sale for a dollar. Sold this last night for $15.50. I think I showed this to you guys last week. This is the... Eva Zeisel plate had a chip in it. So I asked for $24.99 as the initial bid and that's what it sold for. So that's going to be shipped out this week. Uh, she finally paid me for it. I had to open an unpaid item case on her. But I paid a dollar, May 25. And let's see, this little Waterford Crystal ring holder, I paid $3.00 at a rummage sale and sold this for $30 with free shipping. This book I bought at an estate sale I think last year. Paid practically nothing for it because it was the last day of the sale and they bundled everything for me. So it may have cost me 50 cents and I sold this for $30. And sold this big plush dragon. Her name is Cordelia. She is from, oh, it's hard to see it there. She's from Manhattan Toys, new with the tags. Bought her for $3 at a sale probably over a year ago. And um, just finally had a chance to put her in my store. And she sold for $20. This is one of the felt needlework kits I picked up at the Moose Lodge rummage sale. Paid a dollar for it. Sold this at auction for $25. And then, last but not least, is this. It's a WordSmart Collector's Edition um, software set. It says volumes A through J, but there's actually only A through, I think, H in here. Anyway, what this is, is like a vocabulary study aid for the SATs. 
It also has an SAT math um, program in here along with a video tutorial and the user's guide and all that good stuff. I found this at a yard sale, I think, God, probably two years ago. And I, I just bought it because it looked different and interesting. It was a dollar. I really didn't know what it was, so hadn't really done any research to list it. And when I finally got to listing it a couple weeks ago, I ended up finding out that it was worth some money and sold it for $75 with free shipping. So not too shabby on a dollar purchase. Uh, so the total spent for the things I showed you plus that um, box set of DVDs, or not DVD, CDs, was $16.25 and the total, approximate total I made before fees was $287. So, like I said, I will be back soon to show you guys my haul from last weekend, which I haven't even taken pictures of or done anything with yet. Um, but stay tuned for that. So I hope you're all having a great week, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.